today's name of Jesus is friend. The scripture that I gave you to read today in John 15, he's, Jesus is talking. He says, I have loved you. So abide. Remember, we learned about that word abide. Abide in my love and keep his commandments. And he says, well, my commandment is that you love one another. Guys, this is his command. This is what he tells us he wants us to do. Like, I command you, he says, to love one another as I have loved you. And then he goes on to say that greater love has no one than this, than to lay his life down for his friends. And of course, we know that Jesus laid his life down for his friends, for us. He laid his life down for us, and he wants us to do the same for our friends, because he's our greatest example, isn't he? Isn't he the greatest example of a very best friend by laying his life down for us? As we lay our life down for other people, as we love, as he loved us, then he, when he says when we do what he commands, he's calling us friend. Guys, friendship with God is the giving of our lives to him. And then the giving of our lives to others. It's that love God, love others. And I want to make sure that we're doing whatever we can to first love God and then love others. So talk about that tonight as a family. Talk about how we can love God more. How we can develop this great friendship with us and God. And then how we can love others. So here's what I want you to do, your family activity for tonight. I want you to sing your favorite worship song together. It can be a fun one. It could be a, just a more like pouring your love out to God one. But I don't care if you're tone deaf. I don't care if you can't sing a tune or if you're the best singer in the world. Together as a family, join and worship to our very best friend together. Love you guys. Have a great day and I will see you tomorrow.